Yes, everything's in pieces. What's up, machine freaks? Hope you guys are feeling froggy fresh, fresh to death, all those good things. Today, the Honda is still in pieces from the last ride. We have to do something about that. We have the pieces right here. I believe all the pieces. It's had the snow track on it for quite a bit. However, Jake the Toilet Snake tore this thing apart. So if he lost some parts, it would not surprise me. Ever since I started this giveaway, and if you're unsure about the giveaway, it includes the KTM, my Honda, or the Instigator. Ever since I started that, I've had questions of the Yin Yang. So Dalton, how do I get one of these giveaway machines in my garage? The giveaway started August 1st. It'll go to September 6th. For every $5 you spend at machinemerch.com or 3dmachines.co, you will receive an entry. I understand some people can't go out and buy a dirt bike, so I'm trying to give you this opportunity to experience what we experience on a famous dirt bike. We'll pick the winner probably a week after the giveaway happens. Now how the, how the winner will win one of these bikes is A, we'll fly you out here and we'll have a froggy fresh time. We'll get the guys together and we'll go riding, do something fun. And then what we'll do is we'll ship whatever item you want, any one of the machines you want, to your address. Now something that I really failed to mention on the last 3D Machines production is this decal right here. This is a new concept that I'm trying out. It's a membership. So every month we will have a new decal sent to members only. Now the cool thing about the membership is you receive two entries for $5.99. Two entries. Usually entry is $5, but when you become a member, you get a free entry. In addition to that, you also get a 10% off coupon and you'll get links to private, exclusive live streams of me putting these bikes together and working on the instigator. And yes, all three machines are going to be upgraded throughout the giveaway process, so you will get something Braptastic. So the brake line's on and the system is blood. Now on the last 3D Machines production, before we went riding, I told you guys a little bit about the sprockets here. You can see on this rear sprocket, I mean all the teeth are not only pushed forward, but half of them are missing. Uh, you only have high ones every once in a while, like that one, that one, I guess those two are I guess those two are high too, but a lot of them are just completely missing. This thing puts out an extreme, extreme amount of torque. It's a very, very powerful bike, and it is awesome. The front sprocket is in way better condition. They're just twisted, so we gotta just replace the whole system, the chain, the sprockets, and all. So for that reason, I'm not even gonna bother putting that on. I'll just push it around for now, because we have a parcel list accumulating here. Those brake pads, Front pads are good. We need some miscellaneous screws. I told you we were gonna miss something here. But now it's time to change the oil. On this bike, it's kind of, it, I don't know if it's a benefit or if it's a drawback, but you have an engine side and a transmission side. So you have like half of the fluid being drained. I guess it's nice. You only have to, you know, change half of the fluid at a time because you replace the engine side more than the transmission side. So actually, I guess it is pretty neat. Well, there's currently no muffler to this thing, so I'm just gonna jam out and see if this thing starts up. Oil's been changed. No need to worry. Oh yeah. Is everything gonna leak? The KTM, now the Honda? You gotta be kidding me. It's all tuck. It's leaking gas, just tap the carb. It's done leaking.
Well, the CRF gave me a greener flag than what I was expecting. I was expecting probably like 20, 30 kicks. I think fired up like first kick, and then it took like, what, six additional kicks, and she started and ran good. And it sounded amazing. Pure ponies! The Honda. The Honda is back together. Minus the pieces Jake lost, I mean, that are now missing. Jake, buddy, I love you. Don't worry about it. I'm only, I'm only playing with you. I appreciate that you took the Honda apart to begin with. So I got a bunch of parts to order for this thing. We're gonna need a new graphics kit for it as well. So that way it's a little bit more sophisticated, a little bit more froggy fresh. Let me know what else you guys wanna see done to the Honda in that comment section below, but for now, we're gonna kick it out of the garage, we're gonna bring the Gator in. Psych, given the time that has passed, I actually have some parts for the Honda, so we'll just stick with the Honda. Honda fans, you're welcome. These pads still probably have about 20 or 30 rides, but I have new pads. So I've actually taken the tire and the tube off of the Honda right now. The previous tire was shot. I don't have the tire, but I do have the sprockets. That's the rear sprocket, that thing looks amazing. And then I have, looks like a clutch lever, a brake lever, and then the chain. I wonder what color it comes with. Okay, yep, uh, cool. Not one of those like red or orange chains. I'm, I'm not a fan of those. Uh, so I'm gonna go with black clutch and brake levers. I gotta be careful though throughout the giveaway because I can't wreck this bike like I have the KTM because I've replaced a lot of stuff with the KTM and then I've broken it and like I really don't care but if I'm gonna give away one of these bikes you know I want to make sure that you're getting something that's not a liability. You're gonna get something so that you can hop on and just not do anything to it you just rip it. Those black levers look awesome. Now what color should I do with these? Cause I'm definitely not gonna, I'm, I'll rock these for now for while I'm, you know, dialing the engine in and getting this thing running froggy fresh. I'll run these things cause I know I'll wreck. And I'll do whiskey throttle and everything else. So we're, we're gonna run a poll. And if you're on a cellular device, you cannot participate in a poll. I don't know, ask YouTube. You can't, so go down in the comment section. We'll have red, black, white, and then if you have a different suggestion, click other or put it in the comment section, please. You understand why I'm not gonna replace those things, because I will <laughs> them up on you. Okay, check this out. <laughs> well, I got some good news and I have some bad news. The bad news is, this is broken, so we gotta get a new one of those. The good news is, they sell those things every day. So I have all the graphics that I purchased installed. I can't, like I said, install that one, so that's gonna put me on hold. I am gonna order some new decals for the front as well. The last thing that I have that I can actually install is the front sprocket here. And the Honda will be waiting on other parts, including the handle grips that you guys get to choose. I hope you guys enjoyed this 3D Machines production. Stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. This, out of all the giveaway items, I think this one has the closest one to my heart because this thing put me down for probably about a year and a half. This wrist was completely screwed up thanks to this bike. This bike definitely changed my life and it was my first 450 ever. Man, I'm really getting attached to these things.